Yes, welcome. Yeah. 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 Look at this guy. There you go. Fucking top what class. man. I'm trying to lose late, but he fills up the water. It's not like you've been late, mate. Aye, fucking. It's not like you've been late. You and Carol were up to what? What were you doing? No, no. Hey, we're watching the video. Late if you were doing that. We're watching. Aye, good job, by the way. Nah, the fucking traffic, man. Nightmare, isn't it? Shut one lane and causes absolute chaos. So, I mean, how do you? You were saying you keep phone. Oh, by aye. I'm glad you've been phone. After the weekend, the phone. I'm phone on the ship, by the way. No, no drink. <laughs> and I knew you were going to go there. I'm just thought I don't know what it is. By the way, is it your heat or your legs? I think it's. I think it's my heat tank. My pro everything pro perception, whatever aye, it is. Balance is, is going. Is isn't it? There, I think. Aye, I feel as if I've something. I fell up at a broth. Uh, I vaulted the wall. You've been up there a few aye. times. Cut. Fucking vaulted the wall. I vaulted it and I felt quite chuffed as I vaulted it, but then I just went bang <laughs> right off the terrace and hot fuzz style. Right. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> the, the uh, back fences. Ben, ben Sunday morning. Like you're kind of a child again. Aye. But Me, by the way, do you want to know? I think that's why. Because I'm watching Lewis, who's been uh, be late quite a lot. So you just acting like a. I oh by the way, I'm talcum powdered at my head, didn't I? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I, I forgot how good talcum powder oh, is. Realise that. Realise that. Realize that. Realize that. Carol's <laughs> getting a wee squeeze. <laughs> right, legs uh, up. Honestly, I'm, <laughs> honestly, I fucking talc. I know it goes everywhere. It's nice. It's it smells some smell. It smells lovely. I think it's in the in the what do you call it? The pink moisturiser stuff and all. <laughs> Your vlogs out on Friday, mate. Can't wait to watch it. Can you use a wee snippet of what's involved? So on the plane, on the way gone, I bumped into you, you were sleeping, weren't you? Aye. Sat beside Faddy for a bit while you were sleeping. And then I Is that what sent him to sleep? <laughs> <laughs> then I clocked by John Hartson down the front, so I went down. Aye. But I bottled it, mate. Aye. Did you talk to him? I spoke to him. He had about five run-ups at it. <laughs> nah, I'm not doing it. It's <laughs> a part of the plane. Nah, I'm not doing it. <laughs> Why did you not just go and speak? I know. Because well, they slaughtered him the week before. Two of them oh, slaughtered him the week before. No, we said he judged in the commentary. Yeah, that's not battered him. We said he got excited in the commentary. I've been making noises for him. So I wasn't sure he was here aware of that. But I'll make me what a trip. See that? That stadium's on me. Oh, that stadium's incredible. Yeah, it's incredible. Aye, it's incredible. Just in case anybody thought we were sitting out. Aye, it's incredible. That stadium's on me. That stadium's incredible. Just in case anybody thought we were sitting out in the sunshine. Nice, nice weather. It was absolutely bulging. Two jackets on. So spends a myth. It's actually freezing. No, but Madrid freezing. was freezing. It was freezing. God, ice, never ice. that, eh? <clears throat> no. And did you take clothes for that? No. No. I knew it was. I knew it wasn't sunny. So I had a, I had a couple of these jellies and. I had shorts and t-shirt. Uh, uh, no, a big coat. Oh. I wish I had a bigger one. It was freezing. Oh, well, I wish we had a bigger one. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the first thing I thought. Aye. You're going to have a bit of heat. I and thought you're going to be sitting. I was outside. raging. I forgot my sunglasses. I'm in the, in the, <laughs> on the plane going, I forgot my sunglasses. I didn't need them. How was Willie and McLeod's them. performance? <clears throat> what a hero. Aye. Great guy, yeah. Enjoys himself, yeah. didn't he? Good for yeah, that. Aye, when you go away, you've got to enjoy it as well. Listen, work hard, play hard, innit? Will there be any footage for the room on your vlog? Any videos, any of um, that happened? No, we kept no <laughs> access in the rooms. <laughs> no access whatsoever. But then the next day was brilliant, so we met the TNT. I'm obviously got a hat on hiding the, the cut. Um, is that the Gucci hat? The Gucci hat, aye. He did, can I just say, confirm, he bought it here. He didn't get it earlier. Yeah, Everybody was saying that, but that's a knocked half <laughs> one. I was like, I've wasted my money now, so I just bought a fake uh -huh. one. But then we met, so we meant to meet an Atletico fan the next day. Guy's lived in Edinburgh his whole life. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, ah, so, but he can speak Spanish, the guy, he, he can speak Spanish. So I said, so how long have you just supported the Atletico, obviously? But no, I'm a Hearts fan, pal. <laughs> 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 and then, but that was the, so the second day was all about him almost taking me about Madrid and showing me all about Atletico and, and then he goes like that, um, I said, so what have you got planned for me today? He went, I'm going to take you up to a paddle boat. So me and him are in the river, just rowing. He started pissing down the rain and all. Yeah, it was raining as well. Aye, it was raining. Oh, mate, it was Baltic. Why rowing? <laughs> Why take you rowing? I Why? think we could send somewhere else, it couldn't have been. <clears throat> but of all the, all the things you could have got up to, me and him were in this pond. Paddle boat. And it was like four other like it was like four other couples just we we're all just going round each other. Jake Peter thought you were a couple. Hank so me, aye. <laughs> That's incredible. So tune in Friday. The guy, was, the guy was excellent. Uh -huh. The good boy was job. really, really good. Wait, job. He'll be to be the one, next. Because where I'm commentating, I'm quite high up and he's doing a right right next to pitch. Bit. Right next to the pitch. But in there quite early, <laughs> as you have to be. He just kept looking round. Wow. <laughs> but it was lived in. I was lived there. <laughs> oh, we were in there. We were in there. We were still on that pit side for tours and for, I don't know why they've gave me a mic, but I'm not interviewing anybody. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just talking about with this, this mic for tours and then 
<coughs> see, always when the Celtic boys all came out, mate, you could see them looking ears off. What the fuck is he <laughs> So, can you get, did you get to interview anybody fa- really, fa- like, really famous? No, nobody. We weren't interviewing anybody. <laughs> they say, <laughs> like, listen, don't come out of this box, you stay in here. I'm thinking, why am I walking about with this? So, what did you end up doing? It was an incredible experience, and then. You were on VAR, were you not? Oh, the, we, the, the, referee, the referee was raging with us, I know. <coughs> Before the game, he ran by and I went, good luck. And he just went like to me. Did he? But then you seen his performance during the game. Do you know what I mean? So that's done to you? I think I fucking got in his head. So for you Celtic fans, message saying you made their night, people at the front? Ah, it was front. It was actually an amazing story. A, a woman... Um, that's right, she was saying. A woman's just beat cancer. So, and then she's knew and was there to stay with her boys, so that's just... I was actually felt myself well because actually I didn't really want to say this, but before two days before I went, my ma got all clear and all. Oh, it, well done. Was, it was just amazing, most, man. I know. So she, the, the last like we never ever really wanted to say it, but, but because it's all clear now, the, the last sort of six months you've not been, she's been through hell. So we went up to the hospital just I think it was on the Friday, and she's came out the room and she's burst out greeting. So me and my dad like, oh no. What's happened? Then she went, no, it's all clear, I've beaten right, cancer. Right, and then you get a cut of turn around, my dad's like that. Burst out greeting. <laughs> we, we, I've never seen my dad greet in my life. Mm. That was fucking so awkward for him. I said, I'm going to fucking grip of yourself. Do you know what I mean? Right. But it was just the most amazing. So, so it was right, weird though, bro. because of that woman uh, beat it and then mama the first few days. So no, She said you made her night, mate. She messes this on Instagram saying, she made you a she black post, a lovely woman. I, but I think the, the thing was that she's went through that and then you beat a Champions League game with your two boys. That's a dream. Well, Liam watches this all the time, great wee boy. That was it, it was surreal, but... The, the, the what about how big the flag is? It's the biggest the flag in the world. <laughs> and what was you saying yesterday, it's like, I've said, your Mads Knickers up there. <laughs> <laughs> and the, 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 so, mate, this is, we done a piece, so, so before the, the game, we were in a wee sort of cafe, we done a piece on the game, and there was a paper, and it said, whatever it said in Spanish, but it, it translated to forbidden to fail. So whatever reason I thought it meant, because if they got put out last year in the groups, if they get knocked out, Simone's going to be gone. So when we got to the stadium and they said his name, he's like fucking God there, were not he, Fad? <coughs> You're not asking Atletico fans if it's a must-win? Aye. Aye, that's his go-to question, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> go-to, right? And they're just looking as if this guy, he's like got, he genuinely has like got yeah, to his he? name get mentioned, but the whole place erupted. Does it? Ah, their fans were, their fans were... So he's paid manager in the world, didn't he? He has a le- I, I don't I, know, I, he is, but I don't know if he still is with the Saudi. Oh, the Saudi thing, but bit before that, Europe, I, uh, I, he is a, he, I mean, a lot of people don't like him, he's a hero. Mate, what about even after the game? Did you see him fucks off just the tunnel? Just sprinted up the tunnel? <laughs> Didn't he? Did they not even go to... No, I think that's what then? he does, though. But see, before he's like best mates with him, isn't it? Full time, fuck Boom. off. They weren't the best mates during the game. Were they not there? No. Oh, the Varys? At the red card. Rogers? Rogers getting on it? Well, their whole bench were running out. They were all, like, basically on the pitch. Red card, no, red no, card. No, no. See there, we're seeing it for a like different view. We're watching the telly. Yeah, you can actually see, see some of the backroom staff try to calm some of only doing at times yeah, as well. Yeah, yeah. Did you see that? Yeah, one of the goals, a guy going like that. It was easy because he was about to go radio rental, wasn't he? Uh, but Rogers uh, ran, you, Rogers ran in the bar when the ref was come here. You seen him sprinting towards it. Simone's clocked him. He started sprinting there. I don't know. Roger, I don't know if Rogers was raging because. He's going to attack him. But Rogers, I noticed three the hour before the game. The players, but Rogers stayed outside the whole hour. I think he was shitting it to go in in case he wanted to get a hold See, that's the thing, mate. He, <laughs> see, the thing is, what's the point? He won't punch fuck you, you know? Ah, you know, you need to. 100%, mate. Ah, 100%. Big Kendo, I think, would. Ah, uh, Kendo would give him a good bash, uh, uh, That's true. Stephen Woods came out of the box. He was the only man that came out of the box. Stood my toe again. That's <laughs> 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 it. Weirdly, I think he heard me because I went, there's a bald eagle just landed. <laughs> <laughs> and then I think he clocked his feet and then stood my toe. But I was, I was taken aback by their supporters because they play what was ACDC before the game, in it? Or the lights go out. And the fans just going nuts. Is it a good atmosphere? Huh? Yeah, brilliant. Is it? Right, we're going to come at it just quickly. Lewis is really? the joint top s- Scottish scorer in Serie A. Eh? Ah, quite incredible. Amazing, oh. mate. Ah, but well, even there, mate. No, no. History, mate. Even, even they're amazing. I think you've got to play After this. After the game, I think you've got to play this, mate. Oh, play play it, no, but he does an interview in Italian. In Italian, incredible. He got, he got asked uh, whether he wanted to do it in English or Italian. She's Italian, and then when I when I watched it, I was like, I was killing myself laughing. I'm going. Pfft. He ain't my son, by the way. <laughs> he ain't a Ferguson. That's <coughs> crazy. Eh? Amazing. He's not even been there like a year, year and a half, and he's he's already kind of doing interviews and that. Surreal. He's not coming so to him, is he? But I don't think you get a better no, life no, here. No, no time. Not, eh? 
Hmm? You can't, I mean, no, for your son to go and do that, that must be incredible. <clears throat> Aye, I know, and I mean, it's, listen, it's great that he's scored, but that's the icing in the cake, the goals, no, no, it's, it's been his level of performance has been, been really good, you know, in a tough league, a physical league as well, yeah, a technical league, but, uh, no, that, that was, that gave me a buzz, <laughs> actually, what listen to him. Uh, no, well, like, then the wee interview and all that, and, I was like, I was going on there. That so. was amazing, that, innit? Well, other Scots have played in Italy, like Souness and all that. Souness played there, didn't he, for a bit? Souness, Joe Jordan, Joe was Jordan, there, Dennis, Dennis Law, Law, obviously. Fucking hell, and he's in Joe. Aye, but I think it's just what he's doing. He's brought right into the culture, and right away, he's wanting to learn the language, which is so important. So, what a hero. Is that what I a but I said to him, I says, is it like that in the dress room? He says, no, all the boys talk at all. Uh, talk English, sorry, because there's yeah. so many different nationalities. Nationalities. So in the dress room, it's mostly English, but the staff and all that run about, so Italian. But, uh, it's just weird when you're out there and, because we leave it to him when we go into a restaurant. That's what I'm saying. You go, what did you have? I don't know. He just orders it for you. He just <coughs> talks away and that. So, <coughs> nah, he's having it. It's having a time in his life. He's in, he just enjoy, I think that's the most important thing. He enjoys that. Yeah, I think it's, it's, it's important as well when you go away that you do immerse yourself uh, and you, you just it, admit aye. that I'm here. I want to, I want to learn the language. I want to get in with the culture and that helps you settle. And obviously he's, he's been playing brilliant. So I even just been top, joint top scorer with Dennis Law. That's incredible. I know it's mad, but it's wow. mad and he's still got a good <coughs> bit of the season to go, but they're not good. They're playing well. Played really? a lovely ball, I don't know if it was last week or a couple of weeks ago, right on the boy's toe, boy takes a great touch, runs through and scores. Fucking 60 yeah. yard diag right on his toe. Is that big zertsy? Assist it was, big he got an assist. I like big zertsy. He's good me at him, isn't he? Oh, I, I, he can be a wee bit frustrating, aye. the big fella. And he flicks it all the time. I've had a wee chat with him. Aye, I was brought him in when he told me. Uh, about flicking like, the ball? Aye, about telling flicks. him just hold the ball, do the simple things and all that. <laughs> and his dad's a big brutey, a man and all that. And I love his dad, don't you? Aye, because his dad's, because I'm looking at me going, there's a wee daft Scottish boy, you know uh, what I mean? And I'm saying, do the simple things, do, just do the basics. Did you know you were a player? A, what? No, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying, uh, but I'm just saying to him, I know, but right. because when he's in a wee bit of soapy bubble and he needs to produce a wee bit of magic, he can do it. But it's just at times hard and get the team up. And, but they play some good stuff. Who's the boy that set him up the other day as well? He's a player. The wee winger's good, Orsalini. Winger, that's him. Oh, but Orsalini's good. Uh, that was him. Aye. And Doy is my favourite, uh, the Swiss boy. Right. They brought him to the club. They've got four wingers, all good wingers. Orsalini, and Doy, uh, what's the other one? So the other Italian boy. He's got a mad name, but, uh, no, they've, they've got four good wingers and they like to play mm. with Woods and their team. Do they good. spend a lot of money? No, they're a selling club. That's Are what they, they do. It's like, uh, you look at the, the Dunmore Hickey. They buy them for what, what was it, two million? Yeah. And sell them for 15. Oh, that's that. So that's, they're, they're known to do that. You know, they're kind of a middle of the mid table team in, uh, in Italy, but that is their kind of the way they go about it. It's like, mm. it's like, who would you class that in Scotland? I kind of, that it's a selling club, what? Like, Miss Scottish teams, are I know, but, uh, it's, but that's what they do. They, they try and source good young players, bring them in, improve them, <coughs> and hopefully sell them on and make a few bob. Brilliant. So, man. What a boy. So, so, so every, it's win win, isn't it? No, it's magic. You need to watch that interview being about doing that in the town. You know, ah, it's fascinating, funny. Isn't it? I just quite, I think it's quite fun. Get the accent on you. Uh, he's got to be twang now, isn't it? There is a wee twang there, isn't it? Uh, uh, I think you've got to do that, isn't no, you? No, he needs to rap that, mate. No, I'll, I'll, like I'll like show you. McLaren, He'll be watching it. He watches us anyway. So you tell him. Yeah, let's rap that, mate. Aye. Right, the game itself made that. Is it a red card? No. No, for me. No way. Wait, how close are you to the incident? I was miles away, to be fair. I was right beside it, pitch side. I was in between the two managers. <laughs> can, can I say something or not? Right, be careful. That's what I'm saying. I've said this before. Be careful what you wish for. With this VAR, it's fucked. I don't like VAR. I never have. I've Sorry, seen it all the time. Scandals. And then you go, you get a still, and you get that, and the referee goes out to watch a still, and in the slow mo, it's only that's a red card. Mate, football's done in it. I, I just don't like VAR because of that. Roger said what about it's like a video <laughs> game? Did right. you see the one last night? Uh, Rashford, Rashford gets sent off. Now. You, he clearly she's trying to get his foot in to protect the ball and the guy puts a leg in there and it's a coming together and he's half the part. I just don't like that at all. I've seen it all along. Nah, I, I think he's going to have you, I think he's going to block uh, rather than tackle. And he's hung the leg and I, out. And I don't see the only the only thing the ref when he sees the still and I think Brendan Rogers right, the first image he sees when he goes to look at VR is the still of the contact. Why is that? It doesn't make sense. It's, it's, it's almost just a, real time it's just, uh, to me, to change the referee's mind. 
to, to get it in that that's a bad contact. See, I have but when seen you see that the before. thing, he just goes for a block. Aye. Her muscle actually goes kicks full force, up. kicks uh, the ball and follows through and kicks the ball to his foot. See, I've said that before. I don't know if I says it on here. I think you did. I think when you go to watch the replay, it should be in real time. Definitely. And you watch it a couple of times and then you, because he's given his book And him. then ask if you need to see her still. I don't think have you, you need should tell her still. Because to? like anything, you slow something down, yeah. you see that, it looks horrendous. You can make it look horrendous. He's five years fit on the pitch though. Aye. I know. That's the thing. Their bench went absolutely Off. mental. Do you think that does play a part in it, sir? Aye, I think they might have put, they might have put pressure on because the, it wasn't even just the, the, Simone and the staff. Every sub ran to every, on the pitch. Was, aye, at least Wasn't 10. It? And then at, at least 10. And then the, and they're the all waving. The, they're all doing that for a re, uh, red card. They're all out. And then Brendan Rogers didn't like it, obviously. So he's come out to have a wee go at them. The, the athletical bench as the ref's coming and he's looking at his shoulder. He obviously can see the, the VR, goes back to his uh, technical area. But <laughs> every member of, every member of their bench was basically <laughs> on the pitch. No, no. Brendan Rogers got put in the tails. That's embarrassing. That ref had a shocker. But I wonder he? why Rogers actually like he actually sprinted towards the VAR. VAR's having a shocker. I think he went out to have a go at them first. Why why? Aye. You all wanted it in. Everybody wanted it in, oh, it's going to make the game better and all that. It's made the game worse. I think for certain yeah, things it does, see like you're off sides and that. Yeah, it kills well, the game as well. It, it helps with that. Everything. But with that, it's, you're, you're changing the referee's mind for him. Who's refereeing? You know what I mean? Exactly. Very it's rarely. Causing, I think it's causing chaos. Aye, there's, aye, there's but still they'll never go, Will they ever go back in? Uh, everybody goes, no. Well, they should all get together because what you've got is every game you watch, every manager <coughs> is coming on and saying, that's... That's a disgrace. That's the well, wrong I think decision. That, Derek, but see, the the main probably point is, it's no so much the actual technology. It's still a still a human that's making that but decision. But it's, it's always uh, going to be there. It's still then. the referee that's making that decision, and, and that's, or somebody else that's, that's why at the game. You've got four officials at the game. You've got a fourth uh, official uh, beside the managers and the three officials. If they can't. Uh, and listen, it's never a perfect game. We've not got a yeah, perfect yeah. game. But now we've brought in something that's causing absolute chaos. And when you slow things down, ah, it looks bizarre. horrendous. You could show any I mean, tackle in a game. But is, is, I'm, I'm getting with Fadi a wee bit. Is it the VAR thought, but is it the fact that a referee's watched that in real time and still thinks it's a red card? That, that's that's the worrying thing for me. No, the VAR. The VAR's giving him a chance to look ah, at it. But he's meant to VAR because, he because the guy card. in VAR's well like that. Oh, I think. Jinx, so, huh? ah, he's in, that's changed his opinion. Ah. And again, some of them don't want to go against each other. It's been, it's clear to see. You've seen that over the course of the last season or two. They need to sack it. But they'll no they sack look, it. it at times it, it looks like there's, you were, VR was brought in to make it fairer. <laughs> but now it looks like they're looking for stuff. Stuff for her. Sometimes they go, right, uh, can we, can we send him off? Can we give a penalty for punishment? Did you see the handballs last night as well? Aye. Some of the handballs? Fucking ridiculous. The snow. It's just fucking millisecond and it comes off you and what can you do? You can't do that. There's no intent. It's clear. There's no <sighs> penalty. There's no penalties. The handballs are crazy. Uh, there was a bit of criticism for Celtic fans uh, I seen on Twitter uh, about the level of performance after it. But should you, it's hard going there with 10 men. It's harder for 11 men. But should, you get beat, should you get, get beat those six with 10 men? I, I, I was... Did I watch the whole game? What you was? I thought they kind of went into a bit of a shell. I, uh, I been, thought could they could have been better. Uh, could have. Uh, I don't know where, what influence me the night before was watching that Tottenham game. I know they could beat 4 1. Uh, but that was quite incredible. Oh, oh, it, 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 I know. It should have been two each, wouldn't it? Uh, for what was that? Uh, it was half side. Dyer, uh -huh. uh, <coughs> see, the thing is, I watched, and it, again, right, it's maybe not the right comparison. I watched Celtic a few years ago. I think Rogers was. Uh, he was the manager at that time and it was at Aki's. The reason I'm saying you can't make the comparison is because they went down to 10 men and it was at Aki's. But they were absolutely brilliant because he played a 4-3-2. The two front. Done it at Ibrox as well, didn't he? Aye, yeah. but, done it, but it was the way that they, they went in and they, they defended. Defended for their lives. I don't think they defended for their lives the other night. I think they did the first half. I think so, hard. Uh, half is decent. I think there was a lot of uh, yeah. good blocks. <sighs> um, they were getting on the end of you know, the crosses and defending them well. Obviously, apart from the second goal, where they don't get any, where near anybody. Jink with the second goal goes in, then they just go. Aye, I think that's, that's, that's it's gone. almost like they've defended as well as they can, and they're still being cut Aye. open. And then when you go into the second half, you're they offered nothing Aye. up front, and, and they couldn't and get. They, they couldn't the get. Aye. But see again, when you're saying you're at the the stadium, mm -hmm. there was a point where I think Celtic ain't got a goal kick, and Atletico just naturally 
come back. Mm -hmm. But it was Koke was like, no, no, get up and like took the whole team up like 20, 30 yards and went, we're just going to camp here. Yeah. They're not, they, they're not getting mm -hmm. out. And and obviously go and press Celtic. Celtic don't. And I know oh, come on, but wasn't really that that target. And I thought that when second half, when they any chance they had on the ball, they gave it away. Yeah. And it was a wee bit yeah. I want to ask you right because we're quite critical of Johnson in the studio, right? <coughs> so we've not got the tactics, but I want to ask your opinion on this. So Do Johnson's playing right back. <coughs> That's a critical player in between them, right? So full backs on the striker's feet. See if he keeps going back, keeps going back, keeps going back, you need to go with him. And he flings a bottom midfield player and it goes back to Winger. It's impossible for him to get there, out there in time. Yeah. Did, did you see it back? Is that the Martin O'Neill? Uh, Martin O'Neill was Because right, right away I thought it myself. <coughs> you you, you brought that up. Johnson You've not spoken about that. Uh -huh. I thought it was it was unfair. Uh, so did I. Because you can't get there. It's too far. It's too far. You can't get there. Throw on a hat. I've not Can't seen remember it. Now. Do you remember? No, it? they brought that up in the show and I, I was quite. I, going like that. Johnson. I thought first of all, uh, mm. the keepers go to do better, and then McGregor, it's a, a poor, poor header. He did a high. So you would you know be more critical of they two than Johnson? Mm. That's what I thought. Uh, right. I just thought it was a big thought, distance for him to cover. I thought he was <laughs> criticising just for the sake of criticising. What was that? The first goal. Uh, first. Yeah, first goal. Aye, Cal McGregor's got a chance to he did it either aye. side he's it straight to the the keepers go to Griezmann. punch it but he's not trying aye. to pick him out but, but I don't think Johnson can get, get out you I felt that as well yeah, I don't think he can get there cover, aye, I don't think he can get there yeah. even if he is stop. going full you know Simone didn't stop see when you're maybe up 4-0 against the team that's got 10 men he just kept down and just fucking keep going who impressed you who impressed you like Griezmann's ball for the second goal is incredible intimate a joke aye is he just kicking that in an area or is he no, actually picking that? No, he's, he's, he's drove that. He's aye, picking aye. that. It's a great it's pint. It's incredible. Aye. Boy Leno, who's good, drove. he came on. Aye. He's brilliant as well. And, and the thing yeah. is, he's got to drive it. He can't float it. He can't. No, because the second half, he didn't let me float it, didn't he? Aye. He's got to drive it. I thought um, he was exceptional. He was exceptional again, defensively, I know. Griezmann. Griezmann. Oh, wasn't he? Wow. Aye. He stopped, didn't he? No? Well, that's what. Again, we're saying, oh, Celtic didn't offer much. They had a couple of chances to go and get a consolation. Moe's 1v1. Five back, mm. easy ball. Mm. <laughs> Just everybody get back, desperate for a clean sheet. Um, see, I thought, see I thought that second goal again was good. Uh, see, yeah. the second goal does go in, and that's when you're watching it. You went, ah, they're not having it now. They're just <clears> kind of there we have it. But then you watch that the Monday night, but with the Tottenham game, uh -huh. with nine men, they're flying about, aren't they? They're pressing, they're getting after but, them. Uh, to be it's fair, I know there's a better. It's probably I know, a better level push, playing field to play, isn't it? Aye, Tottenham, but it, it's sometimes yeah. you just look at a comparison. You know, and you go, jeez, oh, that's how to shut down, isn't it? That's how to press. Well, I think the phenomenal. comparison would be that Atletico went down to 10 men at Celtic Park, managed to salvage a draw. draw yeah, Celtic yeah. went down to 10 men, and mm. second half was was really poor. Do you, you, you give him credit? Sorry, no, 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 do, no, you, no. do you give him credit for try, he's still trying to have a go, didn't he? Because he puts a striker on the pitch at half time, he goes 4 3 2. Aye. Or is, think, that, is that a wee bit maybe naive? A wee athletic but I think at this stage in the group, you need to you try to get, try get something at the game, mm. but I was I was a wee bit surprised with the sort of subs or use. Aye, I think like McGregor <clears throat> McGregor came off, didn't he? Or really came, came off, off at half time. So if you're looking for a goal, or even just no discipline, but understanding of how how you play in that mm -hmm. four three two, your the, the reason you do it is so that your back your back four and your midfield's intact, and obviously your strikers need to play a wee bit wider. Sometimes you need to go and be the winger, but you, you need to play as two strikers. Then taking O'Reilly off was a strange one for me because he'll go, like, all the nice stuff that we see, he's passing, he scores goals, his work rate's incredible, he wins the ball back so many yeah. times. And then he obviously gets taken off. I don't know if there was an issue or I, I don't know if it was a case of 2-0, they're not going to get back into it. And in the manager's eyes, give somebody else a, a, yeah. a wee bit of experience, home comes on, wee bit of experience of playing in a, in a game like that. But they just get the runner in the second half. It was, it was. I think that's exactly what he did. Mm. The game's got him. Gone, he just gives players minutes, <laughs> yeah. didn't he? Gives him a wee bit, maybe that wee bit of that it's experience. Game, it? Celtic like. But I think because it, the game's gone. Listen, there could be an element of because he mentioned at the start of the season, didn't he, about having ready-made players for that level. He's maybe looked and went, well, I'm going to put on what I've got because he didn't have. You know, brilliant options to bring on, yeah. and he's thought this is this is where this is where we are. You know, but it's a dangerous game that if, if you do because it goes six 0 and people really don't care about what what message it is. They look at the game and go six 0 
I know you're down to 10 men, shouldn't you be losing 6 0? I mean, I mean, domestic in the last sort of 10 years been <coughs> dominated. Why is it such a difference when they go to Europe? It's a step up in opposition. Well, but what, can, what can Celtic do though to try bridge a gap? Aye. I think, but see, before the game, I think Cal McGregor spoke about his, um, in his press conference the day before the game about the players need to believe and well obviously you need to believe so he's talk, he's talked about bridging the gap with believing that you can you go into these games expecting to get a result no hoping to get a result mm -hmm. so well there's there's a captain saying <coughs> that there's something needs to improve in that aspect they're, they're there it's no like it, it can be that right get the Champions League uh, and that's great and enjoy the experience the first time you can mm -hmm. you can say well players are getting used to that level they need to you know they need to adapt and, and get better the, they've you know last year they didn't win a game this year you know they've got two games left and unbelievably could still qualify if I know. you know it's they need to win two they need to win two, two. See, can I ask you this like, see the gap when like because when I was a kid coming through say, like, they qualified for the last 16 so, like with Darnold Day playing centre back I mean the gap in players do you know Darnold Day? <laughs> I think that's it he <laughs> went to play Darnold Day uh, the gap then was massive between players 100% say, like, players in, but say, like, we're still managing to qualify for the last 16s is that gap even bigger now? Oh, do you mean you hate so because the team to be it's not just the ability the ability see the, 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 at that level it's the mentality See the mentality of these guys bring it at the top level. There's no, I don't think there's that much in terms of football ability, but it's what they've got. See that mindset they have. So, so did you think like had a better it, mindset back in the days when it was going straight and they qualified twice? Because you know they're going to defend and they're going to hit in the counter and they, they don't need to have the ball. Whereas sometimes you don't Celtic have the ball. They want to have the ball. They want to dominate possession. They want to create chances. They want to play the, their way and make that impression on on Europe that way. It it didn't it wasn't so but much. Obviously, not working. Eh? So should, no. should they have it maybe a mere defence? So that's how that's what I'm trying to touch on a wee bit with the see when the second goal goes in, their mentality is no there. It's like it's it's no other night. We're going to get beat here tonight, uh, and many is it going to be? It didn't seem it mattered that much. Good players, but the top point with that mentality, no, no, they find a way, hmm. and that's what that's what happens, and that's why that's what they need. They need better players, but. The better players come with a better mentality. God, I've absolutely killed Daz, haven't I? Uh, no, I know. So many killed. players, but, but no, Daz but, uh, was good. No, but that end, I don't know what I'm saying. See that? Terrible. Witness <laughs> yeah, that zero, Daz, didn't he? Incredible, Daz. But that team was buried up. No, you obviously Barry, don't. Uh, no, you, I mean, you might love him, but you thought he was right. <laughs> 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 That's terrible. <laughs> that is terrible. He's, what a guy, I know. No, but I'm saying. He was just one of the fact that he's came through. I know, you know, but he was a youth team player that went in the first year. Oh, yeah, by the way. He did a massive part. Oh, yeah, I know. Was he rubbish as well? You're spotting Barry Robson. Paul Hartley, boys signed for SPL clubs. They were qualifying for the last 16. They beat Man United, who had Ronaldo, Rooney. Rooney, Tevez, Saha. Berbatov. It was, I mean, Skulls. Skulls. So the quality, there's no change that way. But maybe there is. I think we said, well, I think it was your point about the Celtic maybe need to buy, so like a McGregor, maybe push him up one, but maybe sign a sort of mere defensive player in that for going into Europe. Because you kind of just continually... I mean, it's one point, sir, I've got. But they, see, look, the, the, we're obviously talking about the game on Tuesday night. This season, I know the results haven't been good. Feyenoord, the first half, you're looking at it, expecting Feyenoord to be added like a level above, above yeah. better than Celtic. I didn't see it when I was watching yeah. it. I thought Celtic were We're're just as game, good. Aye. Lazio at home, I thought yeah. Celtic were the better side. The first, what, half to an hour against Atletico, Celtic were brilliant. Yeah. So, all that's now at the window because they've lost 6 now. They go down to 10 men. A big, I think a big, it wouldn't have made a massive difference, but if you're playing a 4 3 2 and it's Maida that's still on the pitch, at least you know you've got that threat to go uh, in behind. Right. You've got that target to hit. They didn't really have it. So, look, Celtic deserve to get the stick they're going to get for losing 6 now because it is embarrassing. It doesn't matter the circumstances, it's embarrassing. But the three games before it, I think Celtic have shown that they're not. They're not going to bridge the gap enough to, to beat the level of Atletico Madrid and the teams like that. But your Lazio's and Feyenoord's, yeah, that's the team you need, the teams you need to be compared nah, to. Lazio and improved. I think they've been... Well, they've I think, they've uh, got better, aye. But I think they've shown that they're, mm -hmm. they can play their they're way. They don't need to be defensive against yeah. these teams. They can be expansive. Be their first 11, 12, 13, strong, strong team. 
the, the issue is you've got a, quite a few young ones there that don't mm. really have the experience or, or look ready quite yet. And that's fine if, if they manage to do it next year, but you kind of keep going every year and going, right, we're going to sign, keep signing young players that don't have the experience. Or has, you have to find that balance. Do you think there'll ever be a, a season where they will just go and splash like big money on one player to, to make them better? No. Never, no. <clears throat> I don't know if that's... Ex I, I, it's not even the fact that you're no splashing the big money. It's just that you need, but just like you need a big players with experience. Like a, a, a big, like, I know, give me an example. No, give me an example. No, but you just mean like 20, 20 million like, on one player? Like somebody uh, 20 million to go, he's, oh, he's going to make us better. million on you know? one player. It's usually like you would say 5 million, 6 million signings. Maybe go out and go 15 million or 20 but, million. Because uh, like, I get, see the 4 and 5 that come in, you develop that, it's brilliant. But will there be, you just go, right, we've got these players now. There's homes going to come through. Yaya's going to be good, these young players. But now, let's go, let's go and stick a 15 million quid player in, in with that lot then. And let's see what we can do in Europe now. Nah. But I, I, spending money, 50 wages, million, does it guarantee you you're going to get a player that's good enough? But it'd give you a better chance of them being successful. Depends. Nah. It dep look, gamble, I think, it? aye. Big gamble. Too big a gamble. It depends is it? who it is. Yeah. I, I, I think if it's somebody, that you need to get the balance right. I, I like the, the idea of bringing in young players and developing them. See, see in the league, that's fine because you'll get away with no maybe performing or mm -hmm. try to find consistency. Champions League, if you don't if you don't perform, you you don't win. One and and even if you do perform, you might still not win. Mm -hmm. So I think there has to be whether it's just just even a wee bit more experience. Oh. Doesn't it be going to spend fifteen million? Just like they're never maybe, going to uh, do that. They're never going to do it, and it's there's no guarantee when you do it because. You don't sometimes, depending on where you're shopping, you don't you don't get value. Yeah. Does it matter if you're spending fifteen? You look at the player you're bringing yeah, in. What does fifteen? I know. If I, uh, that's think true. about it, isn't it? Uh -huh. But it's uh, uh, a lot of money. In the results love. recently have been barely won a game in Europe. That's better. Uh, fine, fine, fine lines. Fine lines. Fine lines. Fine lines. Bar Tuesday night. No, yeah. I mean, aye, but aye, but we said that last year, didn't we? We the irony that. It's good we're competing now, but you need. But to then there's a change of manager, nice a change of system. Isn't it? If Lange had maybe got two or three years in the line, you maybe would see them winning their games. I don't know. I think that they've had. Like, it's the same story in, in a sense that they've had chances in games and they've not taken them. Taking them ahead. And the, the the big moments they've they've no they've gone against Celtic. You you kind of keep saying it every year. You kind of keep no. saying, oh, you know, well, this could have happened, that could have happened. You, the players for me need to go. Look, we, we've got belief because the evidence is there. We've played well against these teams. We can beat them, but there's something that's stopping them for beating that the teams. Is why Rodgers came back in? He's already done anything, done anything domestically. Surely when him come back in was Europe that they had to make an impact in. Mm. Do you know what I mean? He's already done everything domestically here. Even, see, see like, we have, like, I know it's other teams injured, but see losing a tatty for... Aye. To get, for me, he's the best uh, player, mate. Eh? No, you're, you're, you need to be going into the games with your yeah, best uh, athlete, uh, didn't you? That's what I mean. Uh -huh. I don't think he'll lose a couple of players who spring in. I know, Another I know quality players, player, uh -huh. so yeah. Uh, so maybe you do need to then, you said, make the squad better. Strength the squad. It, but it's hard because you, I, I, I get it, you bring in these young, the best young players for different parts and, and you, you build them up and develop them, and that works. In a league season, it's very tough to do that at the top, top level of oh, the Champions uh, League where you're expecting, like the, the game the other night, you, you're not even starting, these boys are coming off the bench where, right, it, you're, you're back to the wall, go and, go and, go and get a hold uh, of the ball, uh, go and get a hold of the ball, yeah, yeah. <laughs> go and beat somebody and you're like, See, just quickly, because well, we were speaking about it on Monday when you were, you were not on, but we were talking about who came in instead of Hattati, Derek, were you surprised it was Bernardo and no Turnbull? After he's, the goals he's been scoring, I'm kind of a wee bit biased in that respect. You like because Turnbull, I, you? I do like some. Yeah, aye. You're right. You're enough room there, mate. I feel I'm like sorry, I imagine. Mate, no, I feel like I imagine. Yeah, no, no, no. I thought I just like the <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, I'm slightly biased in that department because uh, I've, I've watched his career develop and that. And, uh, I think he's a good player, and but how he feels at the minute, you know, it must be kind of question marks in his mind. You know, why he doesn't he get the opportunities, uh, what is it, he needs to find that, uh, does he need to improve in certain areas? I think he is improving, you can see that, but uh, but when a manager doesn't pick you for the big games, when there is injuries, can I maybe dent your, or gets you thinking a wee bit, you go, does he really fancy me? Should I really be playing my trade somewhere else? You know, and maybe looks at some of the other players 
you know, because he's at the Scotland squad as well. I'm saying when he was in that Scotland squad. Uh, so when you look at other players and you look at some, you know, what they achieve, the Gilmers, even Lewis to a certain extent, and you, you might be thinking, hey, hey, I want a wee bit of that. Yeah, you yeah. know what I mean? I'm, I'm good enough. And ability wise, of course he is. Yeah. So. Were you surprised that it was Bernardo? No. Or? I was. Were you? Aye. Did you think it I would was. be Turnbull? I I thought because he obviously brought Bernardo in, in the, the home game. Um, and I, I, think I thought they see, obviously did the weekend. David Turnbull, what he gives you? Goals, the distance. Strikes. Right, that's when teams, see when teams are that's sometimes, off. and that's yeah. sometimes in these games. That's what you need. Somebody that does can produce some, a bit of magic out of nothing. that distance, yeah. and he's uh, and he's class at that, isn't he? Without yeah. a shadow of a doubt. So that's how I would always try and get him in the my side. Uh -huh. So I would. So did, what did you say? You're surprised because Bernardo's. I, well, I come on. Yeah, I come on, and look, it's, it's tough coming on so early as, as well when Hattie goes off. Um, I thought he tired. Uh -huh. It was one of them where you knew it was going to be another another shift, but it's not like he's played consecutive games. I get against it against because, it. as you say, if you're sitting he's playing against a team that sits back, Davies the one that'll you know take the shot, shot on for distance and and find that wee killer pass. Mm -hmm. Maybe you know the type of game he's thinking that you know Bernardo obviously must. I've not seen enough of him to to tell you actually what type of player he yeah, is. He is. Um, but you know that. We're talking about bringing in young players, and I know he is, you know, relatively young, but he's got experience of playing for Benfica. You would expect that these are the games that he's been brought into the club for. So, yeah. I, because you're thinking, well, Davy's done well, it'd be, be good to see him get another start, but not really because that's probably why he was brought to the club. But see if he's in your mind to play on that that game on the Tuesday. Is it strange that you never play? You don't play him in the start because, like you say, I thought he looked tired when. Probably mm. due to a lack of game time. It's not like Aye. it's a good point. He mate. just gets flung in again on the Tuesday. Do you know what I mean? With a, a game on the Saturday. I don't think he was ever going to play Turnbull against Atletico. I just don't. I think when the, the two games St Mirren and Ross County where they're sitting in the rain box, so he's a perfect player to play. I don't think Rogers against it's going to have a lot of the ball at times. I think he was always going to play him. So you'd have expected him to play more. Yeah, than I don't, didn't you? At the weekend to get him up to speed Aye, for that. Be ready, but Atletico game. Uh -huh. He's uh, a bit. Turnbull's the greatest player in history outside the box. <laughs> <laughs> mate, somebody needs to check his goal ratio. The bell. Ah, it's high, mate. Outside, Man. outside the box. He's shoot. He's you see for a young age, he'd take they shooting, and he'd like it. Had it with the laces, but so controlled. Yeah. You no, know he's aiming for the top corner, and it's gone in the top hmm. corner. Cause see, 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 at first glance, it does look like he's bent it, and doesn't it? But Aye. when the camera, he actually does hit it, but it's, he's got the control mate, of bending it. How many goals he scores like that? Uh -huh. See the see the one against Mirren he hits it and it looks like it takes a nick because he cuts across it and it, it goes towards the goal and comes away. Yeah. And you're like, to, because I know him, people might be think, oh, he's maybe not hit that as well as he'd like. But he had one against Ross County where the exact same thing, but it's just lower, but he cuts across What's it. It's starting to bend away, so he's obviously I think it's he'll, intentional. I think he'll want to leave soon. Yeah, I think he's, he's, he's too good a player. Uh -huh. He's got a contract in the summer. Isn't summer uh -huh. He's too good a player in big games. Not, not to be playing. I think you know, not to be sitting on the bench. He'll not be happy. Now. I think he could go somewhere like in Italy. I think, I think that would be the minute. best yeah, thing for him today is go abroad somewhere. Mm -hmm. If he's yeah, not going to get game, look, the best thing for him would be to get in the Celtic team and and play every week and and, and be you know a big player for them. But if he doesn't, then go and go and go abroad. He's some player. There's no way he's getting a fluent. Italian and it'll be a big day no. uh, we, we guy for Hamilton. <laughs> you never know. A wee guy for uh, Hamilton, and a wee guy for Mother who's talking Italian. <laughs> it's unbelievable. Bad, to each other. The world's gone bad. Is he pals you Aye. Aye, when tight. they were in the Scots. Aye, they, they hung about together and that. But that's why, why I was saying earlier, he'll maybe look at Gilmer, Aye. he'll look, maybe lose to a certain you extent as well, you? and he'll go, ah, I, want a, I want a bit of that, I want a piece of that. Short career. Like right, Ferguson, the Champions League next year. We need to see him on the Champions League. Win it. That'll know. be some badge. Oh, win it. Uh, Derek, talking to Big Zutzy. Hold on, big man. Hang in, big man. Hey, two touched. <laughs> touch set. 
I'm I'd gonna love to know what's going through that guy's mind when he's saying that. Baffling, that. He's like, don't baffled. <laughs> Looking about going, this wee guy just keeps <laughs> shouting at me. I don't know and what he's, he's saying to me. I'll show you. I'll dig this picture out later. He's a monster, I know. See him here beside him. Do you just go up and tap him? Or how do you like really, Because he comes around and he's in that area. And do you just go all big man or do you go... Aye, I know. It's terrible, isn't it? All big man, isn't it? Just get on that. It's so aggressive. Just so really aggressive. Oh, big man. You need to start doing the basics better. Does <laughs> Lewis, does Lewis get rage at me? Aye, but Lewis, a wee bit. You know, how, many red, how many red wines have you had by this point? No, uh, no in the, the players' lounge, no, just a few beers. But <laughs> No, it's when you see something well, that's and incredible. you know it's there. Yeah. There's a good player and if he just does it, because he's got all the kind of wee skill, wee fancy bits. We know you can, that's what I was saying to him. We know you can do that. I know you're a good player. Just hold it in a bit more. Pop it off and go again. Begin. <laughs> ah, the next it? time next Fuck time he goes out the big man's holding in hey tell you better innit better, better keep better doing it for you. basic I, it's, and it's what because, was David just like you shut and do you want to know something not a problem <laughs> <laughs> what was David just like shut you would, would you go for it? I would, I'd get aggressive. Wouldn't you get, the, the wee Scottish just come there, and you'd get, start to get like, aggressive. But no, I was listening, I was talking to his old man and all, because I was asking Carol. Where is he? Who is that guy? So you went and found these. Did you say he's that your boy needs to hold it in with? Aye, uh, because but he's a nice. Right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I like it. I like it, but, but it's just how aggressive you'll look. No, you're but, not meaning it, but you'll look so aggressive. He's not listening. It's his dad. <laughs> I'm going to tell his dad as well. <laughs> and it's because I like him. I like. Uh, so it's like, do you know what I mean? I uh, know you're mad. And I like the boy. I think he's a decent fool, but the boy posh. You know, his girlfriend's absolutely stunning. <laughs> <laughs> Lena, Lena. She sits beside me and she talks <laughs> like that. She talks like you're Gravison. <laughs> oh, I do you tell her what he could do better? No, I just celebrate with her. <laughs> 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 oh, what a clean! Aye, oh, what a clean! <laughs> <laughs> I was. I go. I just put him there. Oh, I just put him there. I just put him there beside the missus. So as I, so she, she's good laugh. She's got good patter. So she has. Oh, I hear all my. Imagine his dad. His dad must be so confused. Man. Aye. What does his dad say back to him? You say that yeah, they, they speak good English. But see, when you see his boys to hold up, what does his dad? I, I, but I'm just saying, there's so much more that your boy can do to that? kick on. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I love it so much. There's but so it is, much it's like because, and, and I think he knows what I'm trying to say that his boys are a top player. I mean, he went there for they, they bought him for about eight months. Is it by him? Is it by him? Is it by him? Right. So there's my example. Could could Celtic like went and got him there? Well, do you want to know something? Right, because there I was saying to Lewis, by the way, Rangers, how could they know go, go and get the boy and die? Uh -huh. The Swiss boy, because I think he's top drawer. He's, he's just <clears throat> perfect player for Rangers. He's pacey, he's direct, with. Well, oh, you be paid pairs wages wise, Derek? They don't pay that, no. Uh -huh. Of course, a Rangers or a Celtic aye, could but afford, it's afford that. Way, it? I don't know. Is so, it? Aye. But I'm saying, what did he cost? I think he cost only about two or three million, the boy and die. I mean, I'm just bringing him but up. Then I get the point that he didn't need to go and spend big, huge money. Uh, there is players at the Aye. No, that's, that's what I'm saying. That's what I mean. It's no, they're, they're, no, they're, they're there. Spend the 20 uh, million. It's yeah, get yeah, yeah. players that can have an impact Ready straight away. Yeah. It's no, and it's not, it's no about. Aye. Oh, the main guess there's a wee boy went to Forest for 10 million. And I don't know what Bologna uh, paid for him, but they're, they're, they've certainly made a profit in him. And he's doing all right because you can, uh, there you go. I wouldn't be too fussed about watching Nottingham Forest, but every now and again it comes on match a day, you're, you're looking for wee Domingos to see how well he's doing. Uh -huh. He's doing really well. So and that's what they spent, 10 million. So, so they're still good. qualified, you know that? <laughs> do you think uh -huh. they will? They need to win their last two I games. just think, they, see the they reason? can actually qualify I'd... for the next round if they beat Lazio 2-0 and then beat Feyenoord and Atletico Madrid win their two games. It's a big if. Head to head. Uh, oh, it's a big if. The, the if is because of what Lazio, of, uh, Lazio against... Bologna were different class in the first half. Aye. And that's what I'm saying. But I'll what was the difference you've seen in them? I'll give you insight because the, the tactic, Bologna were going to get after them. Get the, the crowd, you know, let go on and get on the front foot. And I've, I watched the game and for five minutes they couldn't get near them. They couldn't touch the ball. And that's when Hank Lewis says, he says they turned and they were looking at each other and going, right, we're not getting this so ball. Is this, I like to playing it for the back. <laughs> aye. Aye. And then the press was, because Bologna like to play it, they couldn't get it because their press was brilliant as well. But their possession of the ball, it's, they were just they were buying on it. And that's what, they great at that Celtic pack. I didn't yeah. think. Yeah, no, they were great at that. I'm saying, no, and I think they've got, a, they've got, got better. they have got better. But that's what Lewis was saying. Going, 
Right, we're not getting this ball after them, but we just need to kind of keep our shape, work our backside off, and have that mentality, and, and keep grinding away, grinding away, and that's what happened. And they've beat them one nothing. That's you right. know, maybe, that's the goal. That was a game Liam Lewis scored. Aye, uh, but you know, but they had to grind. They had to just sit in and stick in and keep at it without the ball. And that's, I mean, that's, what I'm trying to say, that's a mentality thing. Sometimes it's, did I have that mentality? Absolutely not. That killed me, by the way, because you want to be on the ball. But so that's how I tip my cap to them. So did the players do that themselves, do you think? They've, it was in like the group, aye. Because they went after them. Because I've had realized. a wee look, aye, they've realised we're not getting them, by the way, so we need to just oh, yeah. kind of sit off a wee bit and just <sighs> deny them. We've never really spoken about it. Do you think will be a top manager, huh? Aye. I, I don't think Mott will be there at the what? end of the season. The way he's got the, the team playing in that. So that's a whole new team that he's brought in. Mm. And they're, they're doing pretty well. And when they come in uh, last season, you know, he yeah. turned things around because <clears throat> they were struggling. Yeah, At the start yeah, of the last season, yeah. he's going to remember. So he's turned it around. So he's. Uh, what a player he was, I love I him. I know, wasn't he? He would take the ball in the six yard box up and up his ass, wouldn't he? Uh -huh. Did you think Lewis was going to have this impact there as quickly as he has? No, I just wanted him to settle and get some games. Was so, that? aye, so. Ah, he's exceeded my ex expectation, but uh, but he, what I believe is different to what he believes. Aye. He's, he, uh, you see that when he went to Aberdeen? Because mm -hmm. people like, oh, Lewis Ferguson, young player, good young player. Squad player. Going to Aberdeen. Squad player. Uh, wow. Let's see how he develops. Bang, straight in. Straight in. Uh -huh. And that's, I mean, that's what you need. Yeah. Not there, he's not there to hang about. Oh, there to go and, it's incredible what he's done. Uh, just <laughs> for the Lazio game, are you going to guess your... You gonna read up, gonna watch them and read up on them and gaze a wee bit. I want them to wear. Why don't you go? That's what I'm saying. Uh, you should get. You two together. Oh aye. That would be, <laughs> that'd be great. The Celtic fans place. will love you, mate. Celtic fans really. will love you. <coughs> <coughs> they actually when we were earlier we were all saying about him. Oh mate, see the amount of Celtic fans that now like you, mate. It's incredible. <laughs> aye, you sure? Uh -huh. Honestly, I'll be able to show you a Scottish compliment in it. Uh, it's a see that people like you. You're a prick, but now they like you, mate. I think she ain't silly can do it. I don't know. I, I do you know what he's saying that way? How can you think that? Like he can't win a game. Mm. Nah, he's in it. I know, I don't really. <laughs> <laughs> but I just, I think you've got to. I don't even know how you approach the game. I thought I get. I, the I same was, way, they'll not, they'll, they'll not approach well, it any different. But do you think that's true? We do not look at a Bologna and think, right, that's how they were successful against them there. That not happen. No. No. I look, there'll be elements where how they press and and where they try and force the ball to win it back, I of course they're going to have to look at that, but it will still be the same the same way. It, you know, you said after the game about why why did you know just pack the defence, sit back? It's, it's not the way I it's not the way I play. Mm. They're so, not going to have made it either. <clears throat> Do you be it? Aye. Which is a massive miss. He's been good in Europe, man. Uh, hasn't he? Especially the way that if you want to press in that. Yeah. All right. Just before we go to Aberdeen, but because we just touched on it a wee bit, but Big Ange didn't there. <coughs> Mate, that line is incredible. He's a hero. Bonkers. Isn't it? Bonkers, mate, but brilliant. But, but, aye. Mad, but genius. Isn't it? Aye. He's a hero. See, the Tottenham legendary captain, is it Perryman or someone's came out and just said, best thing that's ever happened to Spurs? The worry yeah. thing is, you can get away with that at this stage where they were top of the league. Top of the league into the weekend's fixtures. I know they weren't going into the game. They could have went top of the league. You get away with it because of what just happened before that. If that was the first game of the season, everybody would be, would be going, what's going on here? Uh -huh. What is happening? Aye. This isn't a brilliant. It's because he's built that for the, the first nine, ten games. I'm worried now about his players' injuries. Now it's going to be interesting in the centre half. A dog he's been, he's been Van de Veen's the best player. Especially when they play. Sense. Oh, fuck. Mate, how quick is he? That video you showed. Well, remember her running back for the halfway line for his last team? You need to watch that, him sprinting for. <coughs> it was, who was he? Who was he? Was he German Wolfsburg, team? Was it Wilsburg, yeah. And in Europe, you wait to see him running. I've never seen somebody this quick. The Charlison's out and all. Needs an op. Seeing that is a good thing, too. No, come no, on. You need, you need, he's a good player, but it's just the fact that they're losing more and more players. players. Is yeah. Madison, did he not go off as well? Yeah, he's out as well. Is yeah. or something? That's, that's worrying, by the way. Eric Dyer. Do you know score a scream and like get chopped off? Belter, mate. For the Maybe free he'll kick. come calling. Maybe a few of the Celtic boys. I have heard through the grapevine that Kyogo's oh, yeah. could be gone. Have you? In January. No, because where, TV, where where's he going to play? Did you hear that on the plane? I <laughs> <laughs> think he signs Kyogo. I actually heard two Stephen Celtic fans say it behind me. I'm not joking. I swear I heard that. He's away, man. The Celtic fans were outstanding. <laughs> but, you know, you're not playing, nobody's playing ahead of Sonny. 
Keep with Keogh going sat on the bench. No, but this is what I thought about Keogh players. Are, top. Players are out. They need. They need um, Sun for the left and Keogh go top. Sun's getting. I know, but Sun's going. Would you move it back to the left or the goals he scored? Two. <laughs> <laughs> Just fuck up the pitch. The best, uh, right, the Aberdeen. Best, see the best <coughs> thing possible. What we was asked about doing that. What is it? Water rafting or white water rafting with the? Was it a chairman? He's like, he's a favour, mate. Isn't he? He's brilliant. He's like, isn't it? Do you know, still hand the big fry up? She's talking about. Because he's just a sim. Ah, he's just honest. Just does. Ah, isn't it? No, uh-huh. Just tells you the way it is. Just as a good <coughs> old fashioned breakfast, isn't it? You, you can see that. Uh-huh. <laughs> this guy in the world, isn't he? Ah, you he's not having that. vegan haggis, is he? No, no, isn't it? That was nice, mate. <laughs> Vegetable haggis <laughs> last week. It's my round this week, bastard. You can just see my pint, can you? It's no one. It's breakfast. Uh, well, aye, why uh, not? I definitely, I but can see that. You can't see him with a nice wee glass of fucking shabbly or whatever. He likes a whiskey, mate. Is he? Yeah, yeah he's, he's a whiskey. whiskey aye. You could take, aye. Looks a whiskey drinker, yeah. doesn't he? You could take it down there, wouldn't it? Down there. Use that. You, sh- <laughs> you should go down <laughs> there. <laughs> you should go down there. Interview him again. <coughs> uh, right, Aberdeen. Barry Ferguson. They've done all right. Uh, <laughs> take care, mate. <laughs> Barry Robson. Final. Done all right in Europe. Um, <clears throat> but complaining about the fixtures. Is this something you just need to deal with when you're at a yeah, big aye. club? Aye. 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 Uh, he's aye. moaning a lot, Barry Robson, isn't he? Like he's he struggled. They've not uh, had great form and consistency, but they're in the final. They're not they're actually sitting all right in the league in terms of position. Mm. Um, and they've they've got a you know a Conference League campaign where this is talking about dealing with the the expectation of, of maybe qualification because it's no Europa League. You just have to go on it. Yeah, you do. It's 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 something that it be obviously you're looking at the cup final and they're saying. There's a game three days before it. Rangers are in the same position, and that's what you, you want to be playing in the, in the big games. Obviously, the, if it was a one like a one-off situation, they'd say, "Well, I'd rather have a week's preparation." But well, that means you're known Europe. So yes. would would he? You, you just have I tell to you what. That. I can't believe he's coming and says that because he's just giving his players an excuse already. Yeah. Why do you even say that? Because they hear that, they listen to that, I and then you go, "There's an excuse." Oh, I'm a wee bit that. tired. Yes. I'm not quite at it. No, you ride the wave, didn't you? This is brilliant. This is what it's all about. This is what success brings you. And we deal with it. And for him to come out and say that, there you go, there's, it's, there's a great wee excuse for some of the boys. I wonder the if it's just, just for the press, though. And, the, mm. you know, inside. Put but a wee bit of pressure on the... Sack the press. Do you worry about his, his squad of players and you make sure they've still got that right, the right mi- mindset but he's, and enjoy he this. Like, player, but he, 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 he would have had to do this. I think behind closed different. doors they'd be saying, listen, this is what happens when you play uh, a team. Like you think so, I, think, I think he will. Like I don't so, know how they won that game. What, the Hibs game? You watched it, didn't you? How did you sure, like? Hibs, the, the hey, first half is pure second half. I listened to it. I, I was coming down for yeah. a broad, so I listened to it and see when the, it was the sending half, I put on Radio 1. I wanted a bit of tunes, man. So I thought that was the moot. I thought Aberdeen are out. Hibs have won this. I get some tunes on. I was bouncing, by the way. And then when I got news... I wasn't doing the way down. Don't laugh. Aye, Willie and John Collins <laughs> were, were doing the commentary. Uh, so I listened to... Because I'd put the radio one on at half-time. What did you think of the goal drink? It was offside? Boyle? Boyle, I think he was offside, didn't he? Do you think so? Well, did the lines not show he's offside, now? Nah? I don't think he's right, though. They, are, they sounded the awful right. on the radio. There you go. Right. They sounded woeful. Mm. The yeah, pitch, pitches are calibrated, so depending on the angle, it maybe no look as if the lines are straight. But do you think it was half? <laughs> do you? Well, what a goal it is as well. I think it was quite, quite a bit offside, was it not? Was I it? think it was that close. I think why was it? It was tight. <laughs> <laughs> but no, actually, how was it? Well, how was it? Well, but then it was, it was so bizarre. Aberdeen were woeful until. About the ten men were brilliant. Brilliant, uh, yes. kept getting. But the moment, the, uh, we said on Monday the performances, best performance this season, have been sitting and hitting on the counter, hasn't it? Aye. I was driving down the same, listening to Wait. it, and it was going. Hibs are, Hibs are brilliant. Hibs are going to win this game. Go to the, go the motor. Aberdeen. Get in my house. <laughs> put the telly on, and it was one 0 to Aberdeen. It's like how's that? How's that even happen? Because you were just saying they were just launching it all the time. Uh, launch. Yeah. It's, it's, then when you're listening to something, then and I just thought. Right, that's down to ten men. They've been woeful, you know. When you're listening to it, I thought there was only one outcome. That's how bad. There you go. That's how bad. I must surprise how many long boys they play. Uh-huh. They didn't get comfortable in possession. They didn't really know if they're either playing or they're kicking it long. But even sometimes there's a, like a, a player in the midfield maybe diving with the ball and it just kicks it forward. It's like no sort of. Aye. But they've got decent players in there, haven't they? In the middle of the park. Uh-huh. Why are you no using them? Uh, Baron, aren't uh-huh. they? 
But it's a massive opportunity for the minute. They're all Cup good final. players. What's happening with Hibs, right? Because every time I see Hibs, I actually enjoy watching them play. But it's like they can't win a game of football. Last night again, seven last games in it. Score. Seven games of no one. But by all accounts, they're starting these ge- they're starting games really well. Didn't easy, they? He still needs to get his nah. own players in in January. Do you know what I mean? Uh, no, of course. I think that's about the last late goals that can see, did not it? Aye, I mean, aye, it would be a concern, especially look in the league. You you can forgive a wee bit and say. You know the manager's building, and I'm by no means putting any any blame on the manager because he is no long in the door. But when it comes to a semi, just find the way to win. Mm. Just find the way to win. But I think that when it gets to January in the summer, you'll see. I think you'll see a better Hibs because he'll bring in the players that, that he knows can play mm. the way he wants to play. Is it a sign that players kind of keep up the intensity he wants for ninety minutes? <clears throat> Maybe I've no I've not really seen seen enough of her. I've not seen uh, too much of Hibs. Mm. Um, so we like Celtic and Durange, remember at the start, for the first 60 minutes they were brilliant and it would be a drop off the last 30. He did say that, he took half, to, I mean, the, the fans were critical, his two subs was a couple of weeks ago. He brought sort of other, maybe better players off in 60 minutes, cool. but he did say they were, they were shattered. Uh, so maybe they can, I don't know. But no, I like him. Ross County game, was it? 2-0 up. Yeah, it was a home one. Uh, aye, that was the game. And he took, mm. made two subs but the fans were very critical of his subs anything else you could put to do it? is it just a lack of concentration as well which Hibs have been accused of in the past um, look I know that there, there has been a the old Hibs that is the, the, yeah. the saying but I mean I don't I don't know I just think you can put it down to a new manager coming in new ideas is it that the players are not able to play for the 90 minutes is it that the players that he's bringing on because look if you if you're two 0 up and you, you get pegged back to two each, then either there's got to be criticism of your subs and, and what you've done to affect the game because it clearly doesn't work. But I I can't see that I can't see that it's got an effect on every single person involved with Hibs that there's this staff saying that yeah. with Hibs that I, I mean I I just can't see it. I just you just put it down to a new manager, new way of working, and maybe no having exactly the players that Aye. you want to go and I agree with that and, and then once that. he gets these two or three <clears throat> players in uh, in January it'll make a difference yeah, yeah. so Aye. it will so it will because he's got his philosophy he's sticking to it quite rightly so that's why I've tipped him a lot I've tipped him the last couple of games <laughs> as well you know what I mean so uh, I think they're decent so they are but they're just Aberdeen. player or two what have you got I, I, I think Aberdeen will battle tonight do you? P-O-K Aye, they're a good team they are a right good team the way they play football I think that'll be a struggle then. I wait to Celtic on Sunday. Who do they play? P O K. Is that right? Pauk. Pauk. Is it Pauk? Pauk. 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 P O K. P O K. Is that a band in it? Pauk. He's man. I think uh, I think they'll struggle, and then I wait to sell it and also. Oof, they struggle to keep you in the ball, be. They keep launching it. Go to better possession. I don't change that will they though. But is, 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 as I said, is this the games that they might be better in? <laughs> Maybe. Aye, sitting there. No, they were in the home game. Yeah. Aye. And the, and and the penalty decisions are disgraceful. Uh, <coughs> what, the awarding of the penalty or the defender's decision? No, the, the, the guy, no, but is it didn't oh, get Oh, the, the one who didn't get it. Aye, shocking. Yeah. Aye. McKen- was it McKenzie? Huh? Shocking. Aye, that was, that was terrible. So they, 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 can go and, they can go and beat these teams. I thought, watched Pout against Hearts and I thought they were, they were decent. I didn't think Hearts were great. And then Aberdeen had a chance to go and beat them. Um, last week, look, it's different going out there. The, the atmosphere oh, looks incredible. Nice. Looks like it's so, uh, such a hostile place. But I, I think the Aberdeen are a team that they, when it clicks, they're a, they're a very good side. <clears throat> and I think they could they could get a result when they played Frankfurt. Everybody thought it was going to be eight 0 Yeah, yeah. And they've, I know they still get beat, mm-hmm. but it was a brilliant performance. Oh, okay. So, aye, they could they could um, they could go and get a, a result. I mean, Nicky was out in this world. No, he was. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've never seen a semi-final performance like in my life. Was he good with it? Oh my god! I thought Did Aberdeen were terrible. I bet him defensively. Just him, him he just was on his body everywhere. Anybody else or just him? Just him, I think. <laughs> <laughs> Single-handedly got them into. Yeah. <coughs> we do. He doesn't fancy me, do it now, doesn't he? No. He's, He's in and out, isn't he? Aye. Too much actually. <laughs> <laughs> That's your game, isn't it? <laughs> You're my dad, wee man. <laughs> no, no. Yeah, no, 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 no. No, not at all. I was a professional. <laughs> Good man. Uh, right, St Johnston. What did you just make the news that Craig Levine's been appointed as a new manager? I like it. Uh, I like Big Craigie. So, I, did, I, I mean, I was As a hat. manager or as a guy? Well, do you know, she's a, even as a player, right, seeing the dressing room, the big fella, he mm. was always dead opinionated. Right. 
and you can see that you know the way he's, he's took that to management but I tell you what seeing a night out he was brilliant see we were just sitting oh, so down Johnson players will be delighted mate the man was good on a night out, a night out. Ah. put the ball away <laughs> see if you put the ball away and you, you've probably been in his company a few times ah, ah, that still surprises me I what, that, uh, he's like, a, like any kind of laugh. laugh. I enjoyed his. Well. I, I enjoyed his. Cu- oh, he can fight like fucking all. Uh, uh, oh, aye. Well, big Graham Hogg knows that. Remember, he, he uh, gave sh- him. Uh, he's a big bit of a boy. Scary, mate. Uh, scary. scary. But no, I've always. And I don't know. I just. So certain players, you just like being in their company when you're having a few beers and having a laugh, and you. That's what I'm saying. You put the boy away. And I, big shoes. That was his nickname. Big shoes. We got in. Big great. shoes. That's the thing, you get big shoes, didn't it? Big shoes. What does that tell you about? Big shoes, aye. Big shoes, big shoes. No, he's a good lad. I like it. But is it a good appointment uh, football-wise? I think so, the experience he brings. There might might be a few other kind of pundits out there that might not be too happy. You know what I mean? But uh, he might come in for a bit of stick. Oh, he definitely uh, But no, I just... He knows the game inside out. Uh, he's managed at a high level he's an experienced boy so they've went a different direction and why not I'm not surprised they went experienced mm. I, I have to admit I'm surprised they went because me. Uh, he's, he's been four or five years out of the game I think so four years out of the game ah. it's a long time yeah mm. it's a long ah, of time course, of course um, right. he's been involved at breaking it was a director <laughs> of football but that's uh, right. managing wise uh, it's a totally different bet, story uh, uh, let's be be clear been directed at football breaking and no, I get the Premier League a total uh-huh. different and I think he might I might Big might be wrong it. here I think he might be a better manager I think he'll be a wee bit more kind of chilled you Aye, know, because so. of that the experience you're a wee bit older you've been there seen it done it and certain uh, things that maybe go at him in the past I think he'll he'll just he'll maybe have a wee bit more like go. enthusiasm and be, be grateful for the opportunity yeah. mm-hmm. so a wee I, bit I, of freshness to to go and, and and try and be a wee bit different as well um, with how we've done it he's brought in Andy Kirk as well who's going to take all the training so um, aye, look, it's interesting I knew they'd go experienced um, and it's certainly different so I will see how we get started. Charlie bought who's up in Perth and all that as well. It's fucked, Danny. <laughs> <laughs> did he get an interview? You just love Bart and your mates, didn't you? Uh-huh, did, like he get, uh, did he get an interview? No. I don't know if he got an interview. Good to find out. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Tom, well, he, I listened to you like, uh, by the way, that good boy is magic. Good to listen He is good. I did miss you, but he is very, he's very good. He was, I do like he listening was brilliant. I loved listening. It's not quite simple stuff, man, it? but I was like, what, man? You can't praise anybody, did you? <laughs> no, I'm saying that's what's good about it. That's nah, what's good about it. Do you know what I mean? There was one he said. Talent you know, and effectiveness, I like I love the one where he said he took half the boy, is it Fash? Uh, half time. And it sort of set a message to the rest of the players as if he's like your main man. Uh, don't he's he, definitely got don't that. Don't come out the fucking boot or you'll be out. I would like to see him back in, but I really would. Is he, is he getting or not? Is he going to get a sniff in it? So you just got to be careful on it because once you're out for a, a period of time, it's so hard to get back in. Uh, you might need to start maybe lower or keep, something. So John's is sure I gave Reese McKay back job for. Keeps texting me, stop putting Reese McKay ahead of me for jobs. I was supposed to Tomo. He wasn't happy with me. Either. Well, you've actually went for Tomo to Reese McKay. You're throwing Charlie in there ahead Charlie's of Tomo right. as well. Charlie's new man now. The jobs are uh-huh. 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 I would like to see Tomo. Because uh-huh. like, what he says is true, mate. He's had success, do you know what I mean? Oh, 100%. And it's, it is strange that he's not had another job since it. No? Aye. No, it is. But, I look, he'll have his reasons. I don't know if he's went into that about why he left, but <clears throat> I think it's hard when you walk away to then, I know that you're expecting maybe get an opportunity, but then the longer that goes, the more people are thinking, to, he's, you know, all right, it. He's, I know he's coached for a long time. And he had a, a success at Kelty, but the longer you're out, people go, they're not really that bothered how long you've coached before. They can yeah. look at your managerial record and say, that's a great record, but it was, what, two, three years ago? Sometimes so, you can't pick and choose. If something does come up, take it, you know, get in there, show and you're prepared. He has I, went for, he has went for, for, for the job, though, well, he? He's had right. interviews and stuff and he's just not got them. Cause um, so he is, like... Because you're saying he speaks well, don't you? Yeah, you yeah. see him the way he is with the media and all that, he's, and he obviously... He's, it's good that he's, but he done it, he, he achieved it, Kelty. I was surprised. Too I've good crashed. Looking. Boy's too good looking, isn't he? See, because you're so high. See now? To a dirt. Rock bottom. It's alright. <laughs> he was kidding on, he was helping Keir edit it yesterday or all. <laughs> so he was looking through his stuff. Oh, man. He read his headphones on, he's nothing. He's just stood and watched it. Can't hear a thing. Do you know what I had? It was weird. If I was there for two days, I had five baths. <laughs> what? Five baths my whole time there. <laughs> 
<laughs> just loved in the bath, mate. <laughs> And it was roasted. It was it roasted under <laughs> the, the heat up? Freezing, mate. Uh, it was the hotel aye. night. Hotel was lovely, aye. How was Keir's performance? Just get it on camera. Brilliant baby, sir. Brilliant baby, sir. Can I imagine? Can I imagine? No, he, was, he was excellent. Hard, really hard work and pain. <clears throat> non stop. Brilliant performance for the wee man. For the wee man. Uh, St John's <laughs> his first game, Levine. How will he view it? Two up, draw, draw two each. But he probably would, it, would he have taken a point at the start of the game? Aye. I think his so. His first game back? I think so. But once but you've just said it, but once you're a couple of goals off, I think the difference here, Clark's back, isn't he? Yeah, we said that, didn't we? Nah, he's been like, out for a while. Yeah. Uh, How much difference are going to make? But he knows how to score goals. Nah, and that's Jay. been the big Aye. problem. Nicky Clark. It's like you said, they've there. not been getting battered, have they? No. They've been in games, uh, just There's been like moments scoring. in games where you think, St Johnston actually looking alright here, but until they get round about the box, they're not really, no really taking their chances. Nicky Clark knows, knows where the goal is. If a team's set up to go and um, get them chances, he'll, he'll take them. Um, but a big, big turnaround for Motherwell. I was seeing my socks turn on at half time. So I, oh, but I can, I, I've, I've got a, I don't know because it's maybe you're here or anything. I've got a, I like. Have you saw a spot for them? Aye, because of the way they played earlier in the uh-huh. season. You know, and I like Stuart yeah. as well. So I don't think he was too happy. I saw the wee, what happened wee clip here. No, he went through them, didn't he? he John's went 2-0 up. 2-0 two and 2 each in the second half. Uh-huh. They could have won it as well, Mother. Aye. Oh. Couldn't have, I think. I mean, that was, was their eighth game. So it could have been seven defeats out of eight. Aye. So it's through mad. the last couple. couple so, of, uh, aye. Which is was just important not to get beat. I think that was massive. But uh, Fair play to players, aren't it? Because you know yourself, see when you're on a run like that and you're 2 down, you're thinking, fucking hell, same again. Mm-hmm. <clears> so, <throat> they show a good bit of character to come back and get well, it. Well, he says that. You know, but also he says they shouldn't be in that position Aye. you know in terms of the way they were in the first it's like, been the, the problem conceding goals too easy the goals are too easy yeah, they have been boys into the ball season they have been people not getting close enough to people mm. and just ah, it's, it's soft goals but uh, but no they're a good watch but it's just it's kind of you scratch your head why they've been into this week kind of decline you know and I think they're all kind of searching yeah. at the minute, and even the man, you can see that. I think they're we spoke about why. it before as well about because the first three games, either losing run, they were they were brilliant. They really played well, well. Yeah, right. should have got Rangers something. Yeah. Celtic Rangers and Hearts, they should have yeah. got something out of mm-hmm. the three games. Yeah. Then it was Livingston, and they didn't deserve anything. Aye. So maybe the three games of losing, <coughs> I'm not saying you accept defeat, but you're looking going, don't worry about it because if you play like that, you'll get results, and then the performance dips the results are are the same and then it's trying to find that way back and then you're getting players maybe making mistakes that they, they don't usually make yeah. um, but to come back they've done it twice now Ross County 3-1 three, three last I think it was 89 90 minutes yeah. come back and get a draw and then St Johnston come back get two each did a chance at the end uh, Ollie Shaw I think should square it to Theo Bear and then that's the game one but I think it's important it's that they, they go back to just a lovely balance to them when I watched them. It was just a good watch. And they were all, they were all right defensively. And then, obviously, wee boy, Mark, no, wee boy, no, wee boy, Lennon Miller, because a uh, young boy. Uh, he's and that's he's injured I, as well now. Is he injured? And, because and I looked at, because <coughs> of that game, that the, when they were 3-1 down against County, that's when I can ask, I asked the question, we, we suit him, are they such mm. a, a, are they that much poorer we suit him? I think and he's an up. What is it? He's out for. What is it? What is it? He's horrible, isn't it? I think I'm sure Mother will put it out. It's something to do with his knee. Um, so he needs to know. I think he's going to be minimum three months. Paul McGinn's, I think, six weeks. Oh, he's got a fractured cheekbone. Jeez, I didn't know that would be Mark. Yeah, yeah, I didn't know either. They put it out, they put it out yesterday. <laughs> um, Did he say he was too loyal to his players? I said, hi, he says, maybe I've been too loyal to some of them. But then, that's how we got into the subject. This is dangerous, though, that then the next game he takes. A few of them out. Do you no, I think it's good. And then they think it is. I'm talking about a better fucking raise my game. But I think it's I a good thing. You could take the books, by the way. I, no, I because he's not actually said it's you that's. No, do you know what I mean? I think it's a good kind of psychology. No, but he did, take, he did say that and then take four players out. Oh, for her. So then they must know that's the ones weird he's talking about. Aye, yeah, but if. See if, you're, see if you're playing. No, because no, if you're playing and. I think it's good. You know you're making a mistake or you're maybe not your best. You're grateful, obviously, the manager's giving you another chance to, to get it. But if you go. That's what I said. The first three games, you couldn't really, you couldn't be so critical because they played well and all right. Yeah, you pick moments and say, look, we could do better than this. And if we do, then you get a draw, you win the game. But once you go from playing well and losing to playing bad and losing, then 
you're, you're hoping that Aye. the loyalty will be repaid. Yeah. Clearly it hasn't been. So as a player, you just go, well, he might have been taught about me. And if he goes in a the half, then he'll not get back in the team. Yeah. And if he, it might, because there's good players that he's taking, it might be one where they go, right, well, I'm not, I'm not going to do that again. I need to get back together. Just last week, but on the bottom of the table, can Motherwell get dragged into this? And also Livingston are amongst it as well in the minute. So anything, is it, is it, anything can. Anything can. Aye. Aye. Anything, I don't think they will, but they can. Yeah. The, 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 the league's so, it's so level in terms of the, the quality between uh, the teams. Aye, they, they definitely can. Didn't they realise they can't be St. Mern in the next place Aye. team? Aye, they had a chance to go five points clear, so, didn't they? Yeah. Um, Aye, again, great character to come back. Aye. Scoring the last minute. <clears throat> Aye, but that's that's a team that's playing well, functions as a team, used to used to getting results and, and believe that they can beat any team in the league. League of her. <clears throat> uh, right, Paul, love you, Rangers. I'm Baltic. Got a call from Madrid, I think. Uh, it's not as cold as Madrid. I've got Humonia, mate. Did you get any numbers? <laughs> <laughs> Did you get any numbers there? Is that Spanish for Pneumonia? Spanish <laughs> flu. Spanish flu, mate. Aye. Did you get any numbers? A few more. A few more, yeah. Any numbers there? Nothing. Nothing at all. Gives a wee bit of Spanish. Oh, they were oh, teaching me. Was, was, what was your keys at all? They were teaching me a wee bit, aye. What was that? Kept saying Chicos. What is that, mate? Our cheeks. Guys. Oh, guys. Guys? So when you're going up to a fan, I was saying Chico. Do you know what I mean? All the Chicos. But <laughs> it's a bit of creepy, isn't it? Aye, yeah, we bet. I'm surprised that was what you led with, to be honest with you. <laughs> I'd love to be able to speak, but Spanish, so sexy that accent, isn't it? Oh, fuck. Could you give us a, se a sentence with Chicos in it? Como estas, Chicos? Good, mate. Do you know what that means? How are you, boys? <laughs> We're done. It's a start. It's good. Good. Aye, so that's where, that's where I led the sort of full journey. Just so you said all the time. Talking to the boys and that. <clears> what about, what's, what's my one? Chicas. Just put an A. Is it not Senorita? That's a, like, aye. Sexy lady, I think that is. Is it? Aye, because so the Chicos, <laughs> as we know, and Chicas by us, because it's land lay, innit? Feminine and masculine out there. Wow. No bad, innit? It's Very good, good mate. Right, what want, Arrangers, love you? just a, it was an educational visit for him. I'd probably, I would probably. He's a clever boy, but I would love to do that. Boy. I'd love to, every weekend to go to a week in a city, learn about the city, and go to a game. It was amazing, honestly. Aye. But but you're, why are you looking there? there? I don't know. <laughs> 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 try, try to get the you okay. Send you. <laughs> <laughs> you can just take that foot adventures off his hand. <clears throat> just say it's yours now. He's flying at me, man. Uh, what did he, he do? Go, he, he, gets about, he gets a bit. Uh, he puts a he puts a shift in. Uh, he edits all that himself or what, mate? Do you get a credit card? Did you see a card? Then off you go. Very good at what he does. He's brilliant, isn't it? Just gets a card, off he goes, credit card. And Is it what will be it? the most dubious thing on that? Credit card. <laughs> 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 you stick it away, Levy Rangers, man, he's fucking. <laughs> <laughs> but he, by the way, I will say, is he's got something, this guy. Clint. Come on. Aye. I really, I really, every really like Every time him. I see him getting interviewed, I like what I hear. I was listening to, was it last night? Got to turn him into a machine, he said. Uh, well, it's even the, the boy Roof, Kamar Roof and all that, he's, uh, they're trying to get him, get to the bottom, you know, his, his issues, not just when he's yeah. been at Rangers throughout his career, he wants to try and fix it. Uh, so it's like sometimes managers go, go oh, oh, he's injured all the time, Pff, pile. Aye. No, he's one well, he can... Or say, when's he going to be fit? Aye, no, you know, that that he's yeah. taking part in that, he wants, to, he wants for the player, for the person, Man, something to do well, and you can I get that. Sean Dice done that with Calvert Lewin. Right. See when he, see when he went in, Calvert Lewin was always play a few games, get rushed back, get, get injured for a, a while, come back, never really look actually fit. Mm -hmm. And Sean Dice says, uh, I'm, going to get I'm no picking him because I need to know why. What, what's I don't, happening? I don't want to know how long, I want to know why. Mm -hmm. Is it his sleep? Is do I need to change his mattress? Is it his diet? Is it. You know, is we need to find out what it is. It uh, could be his car. Aye, we need to that. find out what it is. He's a player when you're trying to get back all the time. That's, so that's, that's what, what you want to hear. And yeah. that's what I f So they're thinking about the player, but often, sometimes in the past, if you're like, injury prone, if you're, you're no available for selection, manager doesn't want to know it, but he's, he wants to know. He wants to make sure that you're going to get the best because that's his job he says when I'm there Aye. so every player I want to make them better yeah. I want to make them better individually I want to make them better as a team plus I think he said you know, it was brilliant it, it was about one of them he says uh, sometimes I don't know where to slap them 
I really, and I quite liked that when he said that. Uh, Do you know what I mean? Like, kind of, where he gave him a wee... <laughs> Slap my ass, aye. <laughs> but, but I really, you know, gave him a cuddle, kind of that thing. A, a wee arm around the shoulder. So I kind of, I, I like what I hear. Yeah, yeah. And he's just, it's about just trying to get better, get better. But also, uh, we suit him, because he's like that, even before we get to that, we've got the European game. He's kind of mystified at that European squad with the last manager yeah, he's is left behind. I think he's, he's been he's like that for you come in. Like, ah, he's not really he's made he's any going. big claims. Oh. He's just, I'm going to, this mm. is what I'm going to do and, and, and go on with it. I think he's, he has looked really impressive. Ah, he yeah. spoke really well. Ah, is this a different type of test for probably, not just him, but he's been at Rangers, but for him in general, mm. away on an AstroTurf pitch at a team like Livy? That's, but he'll know, look at, that is a, a negative. He'll know look for to make excuses. No excuses I have. Aye, and I think that's the type he comes across. So he'll know that kind of there'll be certain players that can't play on that surface, and he'll need to be careful with them. So and then you know the, the certain ones that he can select, and he'll go through a positive attitude. Yeah, I just right. like that's what he's. He'll do what his he get because he watch course. games when he see how they play. I think he's yeah. the type and of manager the, doesn't use excuses aye. as well. Yeah. So no, be look, this tells you this is different. Minute he pro- look, he'll know obviously what he needs to do, but I don't think he'll be. No. And he gives you a straight like, answer. This is going to be tough. And we, it, we need to really fa- adjust that word. Fa- Faddy, doesn't he? Doesn't he fanny about? Just tells you. <laughs> just get, can't he? Doesn't he? Sometimes you can get around in circles and they talk a lot of fucking crap. You know what I mean? He just tells you the way it is, which is it's brilliant. But that's quite fanny refreshing, <laughs> isn't it? His uh, boy's speaking fluent in Italian, and he's on here saying he doesn't fanny about. <laughs> <laughs> did he take cap? Did he take cap? Can you have to half time? Oh, I hear him. He says it was tactical did it? as well. So that's brilliant, isn't it? Yeah, I think you listened to Tom on Monday, didn't you? That's why he done it. Uh, aye. Uh, that's mental. So man. maybe there was something in the game. I don't know. Maybe it's because he was. Which, boot, which can't we play? Was he playing poor? No, was he playing well? Uh, to be honest with you, I've seen him better. He's, he's he's no been that great of late. Obviously, he's had an injury, but I still think he's one of Rangers' better better mm-hmm. players. But there you go, he's... Carmel seems the type that would like like a Michael Beal. I don't Aye, know, do you know what I mean? I, 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 I phone each other like, that. Uh, and I don't know if he'd be Clement's type of... I think they find a position for him. Uh, I think we've, we've well, had think, this before. What, what is his well, best position? Well, I think position? I know his position the, because the system? I think it's... Lammers, I think... Lammers underachieves for me. Aye. You know, but and it got, continues. Keeps but getting the nod. I know, which is... He must see something in him. He likes... Does he like physical presences still, Clement? Jack well, you look at him, quite, aye. Quite I think the way he was as a, a player, maybe... Middle of the pitch. But I don't think he is a physical presence. Yeah. Lammers. Lammers. Oh, is he you not kidding? A... Again, I don't no, know. He's, bo- he's a big boy, isn't oh, he? Fuck, there's plenty of big boys, but you would... <laughs> 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 he's no... <laughs> what do they call Chico's? <laughs> he's, he's, he's no... Uh, aye, he's no physical. Yeah, physical, aye. Plenty of big cheeks, aye. You know about that. What <laughs> <laughs> oh, did you say about Cartwell Beale? What used to take? What? For each other? Aye, you they would be tight, wouldn't they, him and Beale? Aye, you Good for and all that together. <laughs> uh, 100%. Aye. Uh, and he daft with you. Does he not Is he not a is he no, get his, is he no, <sighs> that physical type of player now? Who? Lammers? No. No, is he not? No, no, not at all. Mate, no, at is he not at all? No, he could push him in the border. He's a nice technical player. Couldn't you? could just bash him a bit whole game, couldn't you? Like, Fashion things, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> nah, he's no. That's not his type of player. That's not his type of player. He's a nice. He's a. To me, looking at him, uh, he's a nice technical player. Love that, to play against him, wouldn't you? But would you? Can, <laughs> well, there's something. <laughs> you like you getting you getting pumped up there. You get a good pump, <laughs> don't you? <laughs> but you know what? Yeah. So, but there's sometimes that freezing, you, you look at you freezing you know, or not? No, it's not. No, it's not. There's a fucking draft coming up here. Aye. So it's a <clears throat> the challenge is there, and I think Rangers will, will be able to cope with that, even after their European exploits. So uh, they'll not make that the surf. Plus, Livy are struggling a wee bit Aye. at the minute as well. Yeah. So they're low in confidence. Because <laughs> these games used to be a free hit for Livy, didn't they? But mm-hmm. the situation they find themselves, it's more than just a free oh, hit. Oh, they need to start getting points, definitely. So the plus is it's St Johnson Ross County play each other for Livy as well now. Somebody will mm. drop points. Aye, <clears throat> aye, aye. I suppose so, but they need to concentrate on themselves. They yeah. can't be looking this early and saying, "Oh well, they'll get you know they play each other. We've got a chance of you know catching, they're making up a wee bit of ground." They just need to get back to being that level that they all know, hard to beat, hard to play against, horrible team at times. And then when they've, they've got good players that can go and you know, create in the final third. 
Moet je wel wat vries voor mijn bek, die zakje staan? Just, just go out of my own, you're gonna fix get out of that! Flashbacks, and then that Spanish room, and then that Spanish hotel room. Did you ever have three some of his dad? It's incredible, man. Oh, what? Man. That's a terrible question. I know, it's, it's, it's shocking. It's terrible. So obviously, you, you know, he was up to in no. Spain. Oh. <laughs> You'd be the middleman in that threesome as well. Oh, jeez, though. See, uh, realistically, bottom two positions, because Aberdeen will not get dragged into that. Hearts or no, they talk the teams. Who who are the ones that you could see getting dragged into that bottom two? We're talking St Johnston, Ross County, Levy and Motherwell. No Motherwell. No think Motherwell, no. They've just got to be careful. Motherwell, I think. But uh, but they could, they, could they, they could. they be a team or have you seen enough of them that they'll not be doing that? Do you know any more, one of them? More often to be fair, than any not, one of them could be. I expected Dundee to actually <clears> do pretty well the first right? the, the first ten. 12 games of the season I really did Why? Because you normally get that bounce When they come up For a lower division You know You see that in Mace leagues You know They seem to do well You know I don't know where it's a case of People look at them And think ah, uh, that's, This is a, maybe a gimme Or they're not quite at it And sometimes They take you by surprise But uh, I expected them To have a a good start but he's done well they, he's certainly done. aye he has hasn't he but they all could I think as I they could go on for the rest of the season where there's no much between mm -hmm. every side right. the between mm -hmm. this could be one where you know if four or five games to go before the split you're looking at teams that could potentially finish in the top six that are still in a relegation battle mm. do you think so far do you have? Yeah, potentially aye. Uh -huh. I think that there's I don't think there's too much between um, the sides I think you know, St Johnson have still got a lot to do to prove they can consistently put a run of, of games together and, and get themselves in back into the, the pack almost. But I think I there's a lot of pretty similar similar things about the, the teams as well. So it it could be one of them. I'm surprised now if a team was cut adrift. Yeah. All right, keep in time. Right. You can Let's take go. this bit away, Paul. Go on. I'm He's got to see where I like him on. I'm <laughs> late. Late. Oh, is that like it? I'm picking Isle up for school. Who do you like better of the two? I love the bit. Oh, I love Good having grand. I didn't think yeah. I would like granddaughters. I, I was always thought, oh, I have boys. Because you had I, boys. I know, because I've always had boys. No, I love my wee granddaughters. They're brilliant. You're always looking after them, aren't you? I, think I, I like, like it. Oh, damn it. Uh, what? what do you speak to them about? I think I like granddaughters. <laughs> no, but I know it's funny now because you think, oh, it's. I don't know, what do you speak to girls about? Do you want to know something? I think you even love the even more. <laughs> my boys, I told you about that, I don't really... No much love for them, but my granddaughter's eye. <laughs> what do you speak to girls about? I would always... I, well, I speak Isla, to my boys about football. Eh? Isla, you can speak to him because she's 8 going on 14, 15. Right. You know what I mean? So she's get, she's at school, she's learning all different in your lab, but you're at school. But the wee and be late, no, it's brilliant because you're... You're in the, I mean, I'm the ball and all that. Playing with, she should be playing with dolls and all that, but I'm not. Kitten the ball, but aye. Good. She's going to be aye. She's got to be a woman crying. football player, uh -huh. aye. Try to get a heel into it. Right, come on, aren't you? You've jeans for it, have Well. Nah, no, fucking right, aye. <coughs> hopefully, hopefully. Uh -huh. right, have you ever had your gig? What do you speak to your girls about? Dancing or not? <laughs> well, what? They, they used to do. My youngest still does gymnastics, the other one, Emily um, used to. Um, just general stuff. School. Mm -hmm. It gives you an excuse. Drama with her pals and it, it gives you an excuse to be daft. Does it? Huh? Which is you don't really need it. I don't really need an excuse, but I quite like that. You know what I mean? You can carry on and do daft things and <laughs> make me funny noises and what fun? Everything. I if you want, I anything. It's just an excuse to be a a win. What would you rather? Have you had a kid, boy or girl? Me boy. Why not? What would you call That's him? Chico. <laughs> <laughs> what age do you, do you need to tell the boys about the what do you call birds that and again? the bees? Aye, birds and the bees. Try to tell them at the time, but they're not interested, eh? No, no. Right, here <laughs> we go. I'm tapping the leaderboard just to let you know. I know, so right, yeah. I belong there. Right, here we go. Dundee St Mirren. Yep. I'll go with. Mm. Oh, it's a toughie that. Aye. I'm going to go St Mirren. St Mirren, I'll go for. Oh, are you? <coughs> right, so I'm just for the hell. I'll go Dundee. I'm going for a draw. Right. Aye, I was going to go draw, but I'll go Dundee. This is another hard one. The Hibbies v Kelly. Hibs. Aye, damn Hibs as well. Ah, I'll get it. Kilmarnock. Kilmarnock. I've went with Hibs the last time. I've went away from home about five years. I know, aye. 
Come draw. Kelly, right? Oh, can I, I change mine? Draw. Oh, no, no, Kelly. You want me to draw? No. I was going to go draw. It's not been that long. No, no, <laughs> it's about five weeks. No, I'm going to go draw. I think that'll be a draw. Right, a draw. Right. Right. Levy Rangers, Rangers. Rangers. Aye, Rangers. Motherwell Hearts. I'm going in there early. Motherwell get back to winning ways. Draw. Hearts for me. I'm going to go draw in that game. St Johnston, Ross County. I'm draw. Draw. All day. Mmm. St. Johnson. There you go. Aye. I'm yeah. going to go Ross County. Yeah. Oh, That's wow. Oh, wait, this is be a good week. Uh, Celtic, Aberdeen, Celtic. Celtic. Aye, Celtic. Boys. <clears throat> Cheers. Pleasure.